it was honestly challenging and also amazing, you know, because it was beautiful to be outside, to be breathing, you know, fresh air, especially after having quarantine for two weeks to start shooting. I was like, this is this is the perfect like therapy. And I think the entire world after this pandemic needs to be outdoors. So I just felt very lucky, but it was also challenging, you know, shooting outside is challenging, not only for me, but for the entire crew, they would have to like be carrying the equipment up like rocks and dirt and like getting to the locations. It was, it was hard. It wasn't easy. I had to get my scuba certification for it. Um, and I had to do cold water training. So I trained for that. I also trained for breath hold. So that was fun. That's always like a fun part of like a project is having to like learn a new skill or like do something to train for it. Uh, but it was also terrifying. I'm not gonna lie. It was terrifying. Being inside that plane underwater was so claustrophobic. It was dark. You can't see anything underwater. I didn't have goggles. So it was just kind of like me having to like feel around and then it was a very confined space and it was it was scary but also after i did all of those underwater scenes i felt like i had like i had climbed mount everest you know like i felt so accomplished and so proud of myself stay in a place where you are seen where you can be easily seen if like a plane were to pass by i learned how to like build a fire and a shelter like everything that i know about the outdoors probably because i'm not an outdoors person i learned by shooting this TV show. And I hope that people, when they watch it, learn something too. Personally, I'm just grateful to be doing roles that aren't specifically Latinx because although the roles and the specific stories are very important, when they're giving us a chance to just be human and just live and like have a story that doesn't revolve around our identity precisely, we're helping also the audience around the world kind of see us as more human and equal and like we'd also deserve these kinds of opportunities so i'm grateful for the show and i'm grateful to martin and brendan the showrunners that like gave me this opportunity even though it wasn't written for a latina and then once they cast me then like my parents had to be latinos too so it creates more opportunities for more people um and then they they got a writer to come and like do some specific Latinx things and so you know it's just a chain a little an avalanche of like things that trickle down when when people at the top give opportunities to people like me so I'm just very grateful Wait, wait, no te vayas. Si te gustó este video, no te olvides de suscribirte y ver todo sobre Latinx Now aquí en Telemundo Entretenimiento.